Zal bin Saad reported. Whosoever gives me a guarantee to safeguard what is between his jaws and what is between his legs, I shall guarantee him Janna. Therefore we should learn to guard our tongues. Abu Huraira Heard the Prophet PBUH saying, A person utters a word thoughtlessly and, as a result of this, he will fall down into the hellfire deeper than the distance between the east and the west. Our actions are important as they can impact on our lives in this world and the hereafter. Abu Sa'id al Qudri said, the Prophet PBH said, When the son of Adam gets up in the morning, all the limbs humble themselves before the tongue and say, Fear Allah for our sake because we are with you. If you are straight, we will be straight. And if you are crooked, we will become crooked. This shows the power of the tongue in comparison to the body organs. If it is upright, all other organs will be upright and the rest of one's deeds will be good. However, if the tongue is crooked, all of the organs will be crooked and the rest of one's deeds will be evil. If we learn to guard and utilize the tongue in the right way, Jana is guaranteed if Allah wills. Because the Prophet has warned us against the following. 1. Backbiting even if it's the truth. 2. Spreading rumors. 3. Slandering to stain someone's reputation. 4. Lying. 5. Idle and excessive talking with no benefit. Every word that is uttered is recorded by a guardian angel. Therefore, Lesson 1. Seek forginess from Allah immediately. Lesson 2. Pray to Allah to help me guard my tongue and grant me jannah. Lesson 3. Learn about the Prophet. If the Prophet was able to do so then so can we. Lesson 4. Think before you speak. Lesson 5. Avoid social circles who indulge in those sins.